Uh, hi, uh, welcome to Tech Tricks Info, the engineering tutorial hub. This topic we will be learning about uh, the introduction to hydraulic uh, schematic symbols. This is the part two of this topic, and this topic uh, teaches you about the symbols for pumps and motors. So. Uh, uh, this symbol actually shows a fixed capacity motor with one direction of flow so here we have only one arrow so this is actually uh, one direction of flow and if this arrow is because this arrow is directing towards the center of this uh, circle this actually indicates a motor with a fixed uh, capacity flow and next let's see this simple so we have two arrows directing towards the center so this is a motor with two direction of flow and this is a fixed capacity type so this is a fixed capacity motor with two direction of flow so if you see this simple in a hydraulic circuit you can identify this as a fixed capacity motor with two direction of flow and um, so we have uh, a, a arrow mark actually uh, a line crossing the, the motor so this actually indicates a variable control so this is a variable capacity motor with two direction of flow over here and next we have um, this as a variable capacity motor with one direction of flow because this arrow mark actually indicates a variable control and this is a motor with uh, just one direction of flow so this is a variable capacity motor with one direction of flow and here let's see there's a difference the arrow marks are shown towards the outside of the circle or pointing towards outside from the circle so this actually indicates a pump and we have two uh, arrow marks over here in two directions so this actually shows two direction of flow uh, and also we have a variable control in the center so this indicates a variable capacity pump so this actually shows a pump so this is a variable capacity pump with two directions of flow so uh, actually i believe you got an idea about the difference of a pump and a motor in a hydraulic circuit schematic symbol for a motor the arrows have been shown uh, towards the center of the circle and for the pump the arrows are shown outside from the center of the circle and we have a line between shows the variable control so I believe you got an idea. For more engineering related videos or hydraulic tutorials, you can visit my blog or my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching this video.